everyone and uh, welcome back to Last Gamer. It's been a long time between vlogs. Um, the last vlog that only went up here for a couple of days was uh, swiftly removed because I had a few negative emails, or actually a lot of them, saying why I'm editing like that and yeah, it just was, um, <coughs> just got someone else to do it. Um, obviously it didn't work and um, I'm going to edit it from here on out. Now, we have a guest. Welcome back guest, Jess. Hi guys. <laughs> Um, Jess is actually, uh, she uh, moved away from Game Traders for a while and worked at Lonsdale um, Clothing and uh, she got sick of that and now she's back at Game Traders in High Point. So um, she'll be on the vlogs and even maybe the episodes um, more now. So uh, she lives a lot closer to me. So, you know, there's always that possibility. Would you like that? It'd be awesome. Okay, cool. So we've got the new Star Trek pin. Um, it's the limited edition one, 036 of 7.99. It's one of the best pins I've ever played. I'll give it time because there's quite a lot of other good ones it's got to hold up to. Um, but yeah, just the LED lighting and the, it's RGB LED lighting so that all the globes can change at an instant and that's really cool. Uh, Jess has been giving me a hand to bring up the arcade machines and some of my friends and some of the builders even. Um, some of them are that heavy and um, we've had to bring them up by hand. That means disassemble them and reassemble them up here. Um, some of the ones like Afterburner, um, Outrun, uh, Space Harrier hasn't made its way up here yet. We're still a bit behind there. Daytona 2. Power Drift. Power Drift, yeah. Power Drift, you remember that one? That was quite heavy. Yeah. <laughs> the base of it anyway, you know. Um, and yeah, there's just so many coming. And a lot of them are not built yet. Uh, I've just been that busy doing other things like the cabinets for the arcade boards. Yeah, so um, Sega and Capcom and Irem and yeah, Konami, Data East. So I'm trying to split them all up into sections and I just didn't realize how many boards I've got. Okay, so this is the console room or you know, obviously non-arcade room. So I've got all the, uh, I've got TVs on the right, TVs on the left, mainly CRTs and plasmas and LEDs. Uh, I'm not, as I said, I'm not going to show it all yet, but in its entirety, grand finale, I'll be going through the whole, um, the whole house or whole whatever arcades and games and all that. As you can see behind me, I've started putting them all on the shelves of mainly you, Jess. She's had to catalogue all this junk. <laughs> um, anyway, yeah, so, so that's it. Oh, actually, I'll show you one thing. So I've got like a display, I don't know if you can see that there, probably not, I've positioned the camera in wrong. I've got a display with all the boxes and all that kind of stuff like a shop. Going to get into reviews after all this is done and unfortunately we have to remake the Afterburner review because YouTube have taken some of the sound off it because I've used it from Top Gun. Uh, anyway, that's another story. If I don't do another vlog before Christmas, have a Merry Christmas everyone. Merry Christmas guys. And bye for now. <laughs> <laughs>